Shit. Oh, he's like, oh, you better leave, bro. He's angry. Why are you standing there? Oh. Hi, everyone. How's it going? It's time for House of the Dragon, episode six. And last time we had another eventful wedding, which caused a major turning point for a lot of these characters. And now this episode, we're getting a major time jump with several characters getting aged up, which unfortunately means that we're having to say goodbye to both Millie Alcock and Emily Carey, who did such fantastic jobs with these roles. But I'm also excited to see what these new actors could do. So I'm excited this should be interesting. Thank you all so much for watching. And this is my reaction to episode six of House of the Dragon. Olivia Cook, Emma Darcy. New additions, I'm excited. Oh, Rhaenyra, I think. Keep breathing. In labor. Girl, I'm sending you emotional support, but I can't look. Boy, Thank God it's over. A boy? Is that her first? Aw, <laughs> so cute. The queen has requested that the child be brought to her immediately. Alicent? She just gave birth, girl. The baby just left her body. She's taking the baby herself, y'all. She's like, you want to see the baby? Or you're going to see the baby? But I'm going to be here with her or him. To him, right? The audacity of Allison to demand this. They haven't even cut the cord, for heaven's sake. Oh my God. Girl. Can she, how is she standing, y'all? A boy. I've just heard. Lainer. He's kind of cute. So she and Allison haven't. Was it terribly painful? Improved on the relationship. Who's the daddy? We know it ain't him. He ain't I'm having sex with her. Not... Kristen? I don't think so. She doesn't want to give Alice the satisfaction. I thought we were past this. So they haven't been getting along. If I may be of any service. The day may yet come, my lord. This is so awkward. We are turning back. All right? She can come to us. All right? No, she's not having that. She is determined. How bad their relationship gets after last episode. If they're behaving like this. Princess. Oh, hello, Kristen. You're now guarding Allison, huh? You traitor. Oh, there she is. You should be resting after your labors. Bitch, please. What happy news this morning. Indeed, your grace. Where is he? Oh my God, look at him. This man is... Half dead. A fine prince. How much time passed? Sturdy. He'll be called Joffrey. After the boyfriend? What the fuck? Later, please. If you don't mind, Your Grace, your daughter has exerted herself heroically and should rest. Yeah, so give her the child. Give her the well, child. Sooner or later, you may get what it looks like you. Bitch! I cannot. Allison. Oh my god, the shade girl. She knows. Think to consult me before you name my child. Oh, she didn't approve of that. Laner. Really, bro. You didn't even ask her first. Look at the blood. Look at the blood trail. My god. Mother. Oh. Look. Oh, that's her third. Thank you, Jess. Is that Harwin Strong? Dragon Pit Princess, I thought it best. It is. Are these his children? No, no, no. Back to the dragon. They have his hair. You too. They have his hair, y'all. And look at the way he's looking at that child. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's the daddy. <laughs> That's the daddy. Oh. Oh wow. Look at this. It's like a child dragon. That must be Aegon. See, Allison's children look like Targaryens, <laughs> but Rhaenyra's. Ooh, he's scary. Oh, why the goat now, please? Jurassic Park flashbacks. Oh, it's cute too. You must hold mastery over your dragon. So is Aegon better with dragons? That would make sense. Dracarys. Dracarys Vermax. But the, but the goats. <laughs> Not the goats. Something else. I know it's not real, y'all, but it still hurts. <laughs> not the pig with, 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 with wings. Behold, the pink dread. 
<laughs> it's cute. <laughs> oh, don't bully him. What is that? A dragon? Don't get eaten now. What if he can actually like the baddest dragon there? That'd be awesome. Shit. Oh, he's like, oh, you better leave, bro. He's angry. Why are you standing there? Oh, man. Well, he wasn't happy to see you. And she likes bugs. Really That's cute. Something's just dumb. She didn't want to be touched. Notice that? Daddy. They gave me a pig. Oh, what? poor guy. Oh. He made wings for it, apparently. He's a mama's okay. boy, too. I love that. Your grandsons are a menace. They are more children than he is. They're savages. Oh, really, Allison? Why is that? You know why. I'm afraid I don't. Don't. Wow. They're going to have a talk. Death three is an insult to the throne, to you. Allison. To help Valerian and the match you battled so hard to make for her, not to mention decency itself. See that to her face? Nature is a thing of mysterious works. Does he really don't believe it? She is telling the truth, but still. Did you witness the act itself? Did you? Do not speak of this again. Good luck with that man. She's not letting it go. Is this because she wants her sons to be the next in line? And the king, her father. He knows. Of course he knows. All right, I want to fight. Let's go. <laughs> I want them to fight now. <laughs> you know what's going to happen eventually. A spider who stings and sucks her prey dry. Spoiled cunt. Oh, bitch! I... Kristen? Kristen? That was beneath me, Your Grace. I apologize. Nothing's beneath you, bitch. That in the end, honor and decency will prevail. <coughs> Meet a hue to that. Sorry. Oh, hello. Hello. What's happening here? Oh, Aegon, what are you doing? For the world to see. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god, people can see you. Is that your mom behind you? Oh no. The pig. She's everywhere. Emmond is your brother. Oh, he's a twat. We are family. Aegon, I kind of like you. <laughs> Except for that last part. I don't know about that. Rhaenyra will ascend the throne and Jocera's Targaryen will be her heir. That's what she cares about. Your very life could be forfeit. Like she'll kill them? Please. You are the challenge, Aegon. Simply by living and breathing. Oh my god. Otto really got to her. It's like she became Otto, right? That's what it feels like. Aegon's like, what the fuck? I'm trying to live my life be a kid. Is that Damon? Damn, this dragon is big. Oh, look! Lena! She's so small in that dragon! Are they together? Oh my god. They were kind of, well, Damon was kind of flirting with her last time, or giving her looks. He was kind of interested. So did they get together? There's a plum cake yet to be served, which will have us fighting over the crumbs. They're married. They yeah. have kids. Oh, no, girls. We are travelers. We've already extended our visit here but he still may want to be king. By the way, Elena is gorgeous. Stunning. And pregnant. We're free to do as we please. Welcomed and fetid. And eternally guessed. Precisely. He doesn't want to no go doubt. back. We have dragons, they have gold. So he has no ambition to be king? Never mind, I'm wrong. I kind of love them together. They're cute. Come on, Damon. Give her what she wants. Make the wife happy. This is the stuff, Lionel. Yeah. He looks we worse in the, in the lights. Oh God, take him back inside, please. Yeah, he looks pretty good. <laughs> oh damn, that's embarrassing. Seems the younger boys could do better with a bit of your attention. Oh, Harwin. Well, I merely suggest that method be applied to all your pupils. He's ignoring Rhaenyra's children and his children, right? I know you've never seen true battle star, but when steel is drawn, a fair match isn't something anyone should expect. Uh, really, Kristen? Look at he's out. Oh my God. Yeah, outmatched. Oh, 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 fierce. That passion. I like it. Oh, that was pretty good. Oh, oh no. Use your feet. Oh, damn. Stay on the attack. Kristen, calm down. Here we oh, go. Brother. Or a child. Or a son. Ooh, yes! Kick his ass! Deserves it. Sorry, Kristen. I'm Team Harwood now. The son of a steward. He is a knight of the King's Guard now. Lionel's unhappy. 
you have laid us open to accusations of an uglier treachery. He knows. Dad, he knows. Yet his grace the king, it seems, will not accept what is I say. Thankfully. Who's singing? And singing terribly. <laughs> oh. Laner. He was at the club. I fell oh. down. The gay club. You in very much pain. <laughs> she knows, bro. She knows. <laughs> what is she thinking? And I have played my part here. Oh my god. Faithfully. He doesn't give a damn. As your princess and the heir to the throne, you are commanded to remain in King's Landing yes! and at my side. Use that power, girl. Now what, Laner? Now what? He wants you and father. Oh. And Bela. Because you have dragons. Oh, she does have a dragon. Like the other boy. Father ignores me. Damon! The fuck? So Damon's not the best father. Does he still want Rhaenyra? He seems to care for Lena, though. Look at that smile. He has to. Didn't know I was being so minutely observed. What is you wrong with him? Sleep. Perhaps I too am not the wife you would have wished for yourself. Lena. That's it. She seems fantastic, but I think he loves her. Of course. Oh? That's what to say? Drink your wine. Watchtowers, a fleet of ships, a garrison of soldiers sent to hold our ground. We cannot afford it. These two hate each other. Let us be finished. Oh, this isn't finished, girl. Not even close. Be seated. <laughs> Never mind. Long before that, we were friends. Long ago. I propose we betroth him to your daughter, Helena. Ally oh. ourselves. She doesn't want that. Our most judicious proposition. Oh, Viserys, your wife does not want that. The king and I thank you for your offer, and we will consider it duly. You must rest now, husband. Sure you will. Sir, some was named Amund, not Damon. I got that confused. Okay. I thought that was weird. The name one of her sons, Damon. <laughs> but it's Amund. Join hands and be stronger for it. Oh, Viserys. When I am cold in my grave. Alice. <laughs> Damn, Allison. She changed a lot over these 10 years. I do not need the blame. Nice to see that she still cares, though. I have come to resign my position as Hand of the King. Lino! He's not, doing, he's not going to accept that. But he's been expelled from the city watch. But there's bigger reasons, Viserys. If Otto comes back, I'll be pissed. You must have your reasoning in plain language. Oh, I'm sure you want to hear it. I would then ask leave to take my son from court and escort him back to the family seat at Harrenhal. Take Harwin away? Why is she pissed about that? What happened? Why, why, why is she angry about that? About Harwin leaving? He wouldn't hesitate to speak the truth to the king if Otto Hightower was still at hand. You cannot yeah. say, my yeah. queen, that your father would be impartial in this matter. No, but he would be partial to <laughs> exactly, me. Exactly, thank you. She wants Otto back. So she was, she was upset about wanting, well, she wanted Otto back and now that he's not resigning, she can't have that. What is this? If you're prepared to pay a little price. What price? A tongue? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, they showed the entire thing! Why? What is he doing? Oh, Lena's getting... giving birth. What's happening? Is there a problem? Is she gonna die? What? She's gonna die like that! This is the death she was talking about that she wanted. This is how she wants to die. Dude! Lena's dead! I liked her too! And they're sending Harwin away. This leaves Rhaenyra exposed. They don't know that's their dad, right? No, they don't know that's their dad, but he probably is the closest thing to a father figure that they have. Is Harwin strong my father? Oh. Never mind. We're finished here. We're leaving. Oh, I like it. Get out of that, that toxic place. Bring him. We'll need every sword we can muster. Oh, yeah. So, keep your boyfriend. That's nice and thoughtful. <laughs> oh, he's like, hey, I like it. Let's leave. This will make Allison very happy, though. What's going on here? Is this the tongue thing? They're gonna kill Lionel? Wait, Harvin? They're gonna kill Harwin? That's what he was gonna do. He's killing his family? Harwin 
Did Harmon just die? Allison did that indirectly, though. Elena. So much fire this episode. And his poor daughter is that he doesn't spend time with. The queen makes a wish. What seven to yes, you did, Allison. Is he like the little finger of House of the Dragon? Oh my god. <laughs> Great episode. Crazy. All right, everyone. That was my reaction to episode six of House of the Dragon. The drama. The dysfunction. <laughs> the, the men. The death. The fire. Everything. This episode had it all. I have to start off by saying that Emma Darcy and Olivia Cook transitioned so well into these characters. I almost forgot that they were played by other actresses because they were so good. Um, so yeah, I'm really enjoying them and these roles. And dude, <laughs> Allison has changed the most though over these past 10 years. We saw her have her moment in the last episode. We, we knew that she was gonna be someone else, like she was transforming before our own eyes. And over the past 10 years, it's very clear that Allison and Rhaenyra have become more enemies than friends. And it was very obvious from the very beginning. These two do not like each other at all. And now they have babies, they have kids, and they're looking out for the interests of their own kids. And that makes it even messier. Rhaenyra, she has kids with Harwin and Allison knows it. And Allison wants to bring that to light. Viserys, he doesn't want to hear it. He's like, oh, please, not my sweet daughter. But Allison is like, please, King. King Viserys, please. Husband, husband, wake up. Look at what's happening. And um, that's to Rhaenyra's benefit, obviously. So because of this, Allison really misses her dad because Lionel Strong wasn't really helping because it was Lionel's firstborn son that, that Rhaenyra had kids with. So it was also very messy. She clearly missed Otto. And then she saw an opportunity for Otto to come back. And then Viserys like, hell no, you're not resigning. You're staying on his hand. Allison got pissed off. She goes, she, she does that to Laris. And Laris takes this and says, okay, you want something to be done about that? Okay, I'll kill my own father and my own brother so that, so that Otto can come back. <laughs> like what? Oh my God. So Laris is crazy. He is so evil. He killed his, like, his family. I guess that makes him like the Lord of Harrenhal or whatever. But damn, dude, this guy is at a whole other level. He's like Littlefinger, maybe worse. Allison, of course, is like, I didn't mean for you to do that. It's not what I meant. Girl, isn't it? I don't know, I'm not sure about that. But um, in the end, it looks like she's gonna get what she wants because Otto is probably gonna come back to be Viserys' hand because Viserys is obviously dying very quickly. I'm really surprised he isn't dead yet already, honestly. But um, Otto is coming back, and now Rhaenyra's leaving. She's like, fuck this place, I'm out, I'm going to Dragonstone with my kids. And that sort of leads a really big pathway for, for Alicent to convince Viserys that Aegon should be his heir. <sighs> so you know that's coming. But um, on the other side of things, we saw Damon and Lena and their life together. I really love Lena. It's so funny because I love Lena and Harwin, and they both died this episode. Lena though went out. I mean, they both like they both. Oh my god, they both died in the fire. That's crazy. <laughs> That's, I just I just I just realized that. Um, but Lena, she was such a boss. She was like, I'm not going out like this. And she had her dragon, the biggest dragon I've seen on this show, and she died. I guess a dragon rider's death, the way she wanted to go out, which is awesome. But what this also accomplishes is it leads a pathway for Rhaenyra and Daemon to come together and form their own alliance against Alicent and Otto over there at King's Landing. So the line is being drawn here. We're getting dragon against dragon drama. Oh my God, it's coming into place, people. And I'm loving it. I'm loving it. So. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, I don't know if I missed, any, so much went down. I'm not sure I missed anything, but let me know if I did. But anyway, another fantastic episode. I really loved it. I hope you did too. Please be sure to like the video and sub to the channel. That means a whole lot to me. But dude, that was another fantastic episode. I cannot wait for the next one. But until then, I hope you all have a fantastic day. Adios.